Hello everyone, let's talk about what we are going to learn during this week. First of all, we are going to continue simplifying expressions. Uh, that means we need to combine like terms and simplify uh, the, uh, the expressions using the like term. We need to notice that sometimes uh, the coefficients could be irrational numbers. It means it could be uh, fractions or decimals, so we can work with them. During uh, this lesson, we are going to solve several questions in order to let you practice uh, this skill. You can find in your PC many videos and worksheets, exercises that will help you practice this skill. After that, we are going to listen for point four, which is expand expressions. During this lesson, we are going to focus on the distributive property to expand linear expressions. As always, we are going to solve examples, uh, solve questions to practice this skill. We will go through uh, the model uh, example, how we can model uh, the distributive, same as uh, example number one. As a key concept, we are going to um, emphasize that distribution means you need to multiply the factor that comes outside the parentheses inside the terms that comes in. Uh, inside the parentheses. Oh, so this is the uh, distributive property. Again, your PC is full of videos and uh, they are very useful. Please refer to them. Okay, and uh, you can find uh, uh, interactive activities, you can find uh, practice, further practice if you just as here you can find many uh, worksheets. They are very helpful. Refer to them. Okay, grade seven. After that, we will come to lesson four five, which is factor expressions. Of course, we are talking about uh, linear expressions here. Uh, factoring is the opposite of distributive. Okay. So we need to take the common factor, the greatest common factor. Okay, we are going to do, uh, to review greatest common factor. We will go through examples and solve try it. So here in the key concept, you can see that uh, expressions. Um, when you distribute an expression, uh, it's the opposite of factoring an expression. This is the factored. Form. Okay, so when you factor this expression, you will end up with this one. And when you distribute this expression, you will end up with this one. But, okay, so they are opposite to each other. Again, your BC, um, it is full of videos, factors. Um, here you can see brand factorization. This is a reminder. If you need some uh, extra practice for what you did before, what, what is the prime factorization, you can watch this video. It's in your PC. Uh, again, you can find the practice sheets. You can find uh, questions to solve. Here also, you can see more and more videos. Factoring, you can see, again, more and more explanations. Please check them. Good luck, grade 7. Uh, do your work. Refer to the videos and uh, the worksheets. And see you next time.